All right. I'm just going to put everything back in, and I'm going to just shuffle it one more time, okay? Because there was one card I didn't want to show you until I'm sure if it comes out again, then I will show it to you. Okay, so when Ganon and the, the spirit guides of Sincere and Classic. This I'm is sorry. your CRM platform sorry. like never before. Grow better with HubSpot. Okay, so. What can you tell us about finding the boys? Will the boys be found soon? Spirit Guides of Sincere and Classic. Ganon. I just talked directly to you. And how about Tylee? JJ, beautiful sweetheart. JJ, Vallo. Charles, if you want to help me, please jump in, Charles. I'd love to hear from you. I'd love to be guided. Charles is uh, JJ Vallo's father. I usually never hear from him, so I was surprised. But he's with his boy, so. Which is nice. In heaven. Okay, so. Classic and sincere. Sincere and classic. Where's classic and sincere? Sincere and classic. Thank you, dear God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, dear Thank you. I just want to show you turquoise because they were telling me they like turquoise when I was shopping in the store in Michael's. I usually never get turquoise, but they told me to get this and this. A canvas will be made out of that because they guided me to that. Thank you. shot it came up again so that's a repeat card that is very important repeat cards are so important look at all these cards there's so many I don't know if it's 125 I don't know what it is but okay <sighs> okay so this is my card for blue or slash hazel eyes or even light brown jasper eyes okay really beautiful eyes sometimes they might look blue sometimes they might look green or hazel and other times you might see a little brown around them like somebody who had a parent that one parent had brown eyes the other parent had blue or green eyes and this is what happened to their eyes okay this person is bold or balding they wear caps a lot baseball caps um hats wigs or extensions but i feel this is a male um so what do you want to tell me about this card what does this card have to do with it okay again not bad not bad not negative at all they have information that might lead to the one of the one or four, one or four arrests. This person has been working really hard, but they're scared. They have information. Okay. I just heard they have intel. They have intel. So how do we know this person? 
The first card that came up was somebody with blue eyes. Could be male or female, but I thought it was two people that have love for each other. With like um, brown hair that might be salt and pepper. And now this person is bald or balding. Okay. And they have intel. That's what I just keep on hearing. Sorry, I didn't color in the baseball cap. But I just had to do things fast. I got to scratch my back. I really have a good back scratcher, but it's in the living room. So I just used a sage stick. Palo Santo stick. Okay. Matter of fact, we got to get some Palo Santo up in there. Any other messages that you want to tell me in my head? I'm open and receptive. I just uncrossed my legs. <sighs> Help us find you. Help us find answers, even if you're far away from California. Are you in Bakersfield? Let me know. Or Cal California City, Cali City. We were made, hold on, let's say that. We were made, what I just heard is, we were made in Bakersfield and we were ended in Bakersfield. Can we find you in Bakersfield? Boys. Classic says, um, it's classic. He's like, there's plenty of animals up here. Animals and turtles and frogs and flowers, but I mostly like the animals. And the turtles and the frogs. And nobody is mean. Nobody is mean up here. We just play all day. We're never scared and we're never hungry. Nobody ever hits us. And nobody ever shouts at us. Thank you for classic. Thank you. For telling me that. I love you. Do you feel our love? Sincere and classic, do you feel our love? Yes. He's showing me some people. before he was adopted and um, I'm, I'm not going to say anybody's names because everything's controversial and all I'm going to say is they say we still love her we still love her it makes me cry I know you do and she does too. Okay. You just put this down so I can get the cards, more cards, and then I'll do the validation cards. Thank you guys for those messages. See, you don't always have to have your cards for messages. You have to be open and receptive to receiving a message psychically. And the cards are just a vehicle for it. Uh, they do help. Oh boy. Okay. okay. These are terrible cards because it's sad. But when I get repeat cards, it's very important. Okay, guys? Suicide. Look out for it. Oh, oh, okay, thank you. Somebody already tried to 
hurt themselves. Somebody already tried to commit suicide, and they showed me, show me the way. Okay, I'm getting all kinds of bad images. All right, I'm getting somebody that's held a gun to their own mouth, I, uh, but they didn't do it. And then I saw somebody else, I feel like it's a female, that did pills, with, wash it down with alcohol. Okay. I'm just reporting what I see, okay? So, but I feel like that happened, but it was a failed attempt. Okay. Then I got near mountains. And if you want more details on that, I did a video about where they were saying they could be found in between Heart, there's Heart Park over here, and there's Ming Lake over here, right? Or Ming Park and Ming Lake over here. In the middle is Round Mountain. Okay, I'm not sure if I'm saying that right, but in the middle is Round Mountain. And I wanted people to check out that live in Cali, that were looking for the boys to check out um, Mountain Mike's Pizzeria and also, I think it was Round Mountain Pizzeria. Um, both had red signs. And I felt that, that they were important and that they should, you know, the police should see if there was any kind of videotape showing uh, if the boys went there at any time. Um, mountains and now so the skeptics will say oh well there's mountains everywhere well when we were looking for Suzanne Morphew of course there's mountains everywhere there too you know there's deserts and mountains in uh, Cali Bakersfield uh, so what are you gonna do just trying my best every minute of the day The last card I didn't show you in the other deck. It was a picture of somebody pushing somebody off a mountain. Off a cliff. Cliff or a mountain. But I didn't feel strong on it. I didn't feel strong on that. I wasn't really getting, uh, you know, like, I, I see the cards and then I see what does this card mean. And if I don't feel hot on it, then I don't mention it. It didn't come back up. But this came up, which is scary. So what that is, is rope or zip ties might have been used. Okay. All right, so now I'm going to, um, well, that didn't last long at all. I'm just going to put these back in and use my angel cards and see what my angel cards give us. Don't worry, I don't have to work tomorrow. I'm going to work tomorrow for those of unicorns out there that might worry about me having to get up early to go to work and not having sleep for the kid children. Um, I don't have to go to work if I don't want to go to work. And I don't have a job tomorrow, so my job is to find the boys. And I go to bed when I want to go to bed. Nobody tells me unless their name is Mrs. Brady or Mr. Brady. And they're located in heaven for a very long time. That means this dude here gets to tell herself when she freaking goes to bed, okay? Nobody else, all right? I'm grown. I'm grown and I'm woke. <laughs> you know I hate that word. <laughs> but I like I'm grown. Because boy, am I grown. I'm grown 
this way and this way, okay? <laughs> All right, so just being a little che cheeky, lighten up the mood because it's too sad. And let me just put these rubber band on this. Okay, sorry, I gotta light this again because we need to have some sage. That's what I don't like about not having my tripod because you can't really see anything that I'm doing. And I like you to see it, be a part of it. Be a part of me starting things on fire. Okay, I'm gonna get, I'm about to get the other cards out. Will classic and sincere be found soon? Will the physical bodies of classic and sincere be found soon? Will Orson and Orrin West's physical bodies, or if they're alive somewhere in a different state, wherever they are, will they be found soon? Please, angels, and please, guides, let us know. Thank you. Classic and sincere, sincere and classic, Orrin and Orson West, Orrin West, Orson West, Orin West, Orson West, Orin West, Orson West. Thank you. They said only pick two. Oh, not gonna like this. It says no. And this one says this something better. do it another time. Will Orin and Orson West be found soon? What happened? Uh, let me restate it. Will we find out what happened to Orin and Orson West? Will we find out what happened to Sincere and Classic soon? Will we find out what happened to Sincere and Classic Orin and Orson West soon? Will we find out what happened Orson West, Sincere Classics. Thank you. Thank God. Thank you, angels. Reconsider. Okay. I'm getting a no. Of course, I'm sad about that. Now these are the angel, the rest of the angel cards, so I'm just going to say a little something in my head and see what we get. I just heard pick three. Just three, and then that's a wrap. I might read from the book what it says, because I don't know these, I don't use these cards often, so I don't know what it might mean, so hold up. So, first one is not good. <laughs> All right. It's saying it's not the right time. Not the right time. Okay? But I'm going to read you something. Um, remain positive. Okay? Big happy changes. I just want to look at one thing in this book. Ow. Almost dropped the book. Okay, so. Okay. The card that I got before where it says there's something better. Heaven has something wonderful in mind for you. However, it's not the same thing that you have planned. 
Ask yourself what you would rather have, the very thing that you're asking for or something that would make you much happier and more fulfilled. Sometimes the divine has joys in store for us that we can never imagine in our own, on our own. Open your mind and heart to the possibility that you deserve even more than what you're asking for and trust your angels to guide you in a new exciting directions. Okay. All right, I'm gonna just read one more. Remind, remain positive. I think that is a very important message. Hold on. I'm, not, I'm totally not used to this. I wanted these cards so bad, and then I hardly ever used them. Um, so I, you, you, Sometimes you don't resonate. You think you're going to resonate with the cards, and you just have to have them, and then you don't resonate with them. Um... Okay, so that's page 68. So hold up, hold up. You don't have to catch a plane, do you? Okay. You have to go to bed? Okay, watch me in the morning then. Um, so remain positive is the angels are asking you to keep an optimistic attitude. There is a very positive momentum beginning to build towards the creation of your desires. You're speeding your dreams along by maintaining a cheerful and confident demeanor. It may seem as though your plans are taking a long time to manifest, but very soon you will see a change. Don't allow yourself to lose hope when your dreams are so close to coming true. So our dreams are about hoping that we're going to find the boys or find out who's responsible for take, making them disappear. Okay? And when we find that out, and we have the clink clinks, and we have the warrants, 20 warrants, 10 and 10. So that's 20 warrants. That means those people, somebody's going to talk and lead us to the answers that we need. I hope this was helpful. Okay. Um, let me just, I'm not just gonna click off. Let me just see what time it is first. Oh, it's, it, it's just uh, 10 to two, West Coast time, or is it East Coast? Who knows? I'm still on East Coast time. I don't even know how long these videos were, but I hope they help somebody. I hope but they're never in vain. I said I would do it. It took me a long time to create these cards and get them all together. And then I was like scared to do them because I'm a big baby. Um, I don't like seeing horrible pictures in my mind. Uh, I suffer from nightmares as it is. Um, that's why I don't like to go to sleep. Um, but we need sleep and, oh, let me show you my pants. I know that was random, but that's me. You see, I'm a full zebra. I'm a full zebra. Okay, be a zebra. You know what a zebra is? Zebra never um, hides their stripes. They never hide. They have gray, black, white, and gray. Zebras never hide who they are. That's why I like being a Zen zebra. Okay. Oh, this angle's much better. The other angle is very harsh. Um. working on a new painting that I'm so excited about. It's Native American and I was working on it today. I 
think I freaking finished it. It's drying over there. But I'm not gonna show you now, cause now it's just about chilling. But let me scan my room of art. Anybody wants my artwork, my healing artwork, that come with your affirmations to help heal you, here they are. I thought somebody wanted this wolf painting. It's called Brothers. I made it because of um, Sincere and Classic. And here it is. But I'm not sure if the person still wants it. But anyway, it's here. Am I screwing it up? Probably. Oh, hello. Let me put my cards away. Okay. Yeah, I'm just chit-chatting. You don't have a plane to catch. Okay. You just have Katrina to catch. Sorry about my my uh, area over here got messy. But I am trying to clean it up. Hey, let's do a card for you guys. Yeah. Let's do a card for you guys. Okay. The collective, now that I'm awake, um, yeah, okay, yeah, we're gonna do a love card and then just a general, yeah, let's do a love card and a general, yeah, because I just have to keep on working, <laughs> no, I really have fun doing it, okay, now, this is for anybody out there that it might resonate with, okay? Are these my love cards? Sort of, yeah. Okay, Somebody's in, somebody out there is worried about their love life. Somebody out there is worried about their relationship with their spouse, their significant other, somebody. I feel it. So, angels and guides, you're still with me. I, you're always with me. I'm open and receptive to receiving a message for somebody out there in the collective. Zen Zebras. The Namaste Ninjas. The Bella Butterflies. What do they need to know about love? Unique Unicorns. The Merry Mermaids. The Merry Mermen. What do they need to know about love and their relationships? Give us how many? A quick three. Give us a quick three. Thank you. Thank you, Spirit Guides. I'm a little worried about... I mean, I know I'm a Virgo, so I was... I, I thought it was because I'm a Virgo, so I started thinking about Virgos. Um, but there's a Virgo out there. I don't think it's me, but it could be. Um, I, I can't read myself. Um, that there's a Virgo out there that's really overworked. And because they're so overworked, even if they're just overworking their, themselves and their own mind, they are developing, or they think they have some kind of medical issue, but they really don't. Um, it's just Virgos, and I do this too. You give yourself stomach aches, ulcers, intestinal problems, um migraines, headaches, and so what I'm telling you, uh, Virgos or anybody that resonates, calm yourself down. Do something nice for yourself. Even one thing. Like tomorrow, I might get my nails done. This has been since right after Christmas? This is so long. So anyhow, do something nice for yourself tomorrow, okay? Virgos or anybody that it resonates with. Because you're running yourself ragged. And everything can wait. If your health is not good or you're not feeling good, 
then nothing will get done anyway significantly unless you feel better. Okay? So that's just one message that came in without the cards. Because I'm open and receptive still. Okay, my third eye is still open. And these are beautiful cards. This has a nice energy to it. Okay, so first we have passion. So it says, allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. Okay, yeah. In other words, stop. S don't stand in your own way of allowing yourself to get have that passion with that person that you love. You're not making enough time for them. So... Rent a hotel room, get out of the friggin' house or apartment that you're in, and just get, you know, go to a Motel 6 or wherever, just to get away from your regular surroundings. Bring a bottle of wine or champagne, champs, champagne, some strawberries, whatever you like to eat, chips. I'm a chip girl over here, as you can tell from my figure. Anyhow. Just be alone. Get some, bring some candles with you. God's sake. Okay? You need to be alone with that person. Or you just need to... Somebody out there needs to go on a date. They've been saying no, no, no. Another person who's in a marriage. Or several people. Um, you need to make romance. Don't wait for romance to happen with the other person. You need to be romantic. To start the train, the chain of events for romance. Okay, uh, so allow your heart to sit and soul to sing with joy. They look like they're doing the horizontal mambo over there. Okay. <laughs> now we get calling your soulmate. Now this is somebody else. Or this can resonate with somebody that feels like, I don't have my soulmate yet. So you need to call your soulmate. You need to call that person that you've been wanting to have a relationship with. You want to have, you're lonely and you don't have that person that makes you laugh or that's there for you every day. Um, or even sometimes. Um, so what you're supposed to do is call your soulmate. Say, I'm open and receptive to receiving a soulmate. I'm open and receptive to receiving a significant other that is my friend, that is my best friend, that is my lover, that is my um, person that nurtures me, that I can nurture, that I can have dinner with, 